their incessant fuel queues are no longer news. The why is the crux of the matter. The NNPC has done very well to import these petroleum products. The main problem is to transport that petrol down to the peeling stations. And uh, we are having some challenges, especially when getting our money back for the transportation. The continuous increase in the price of diesel to transport petrol has frustrated petroleum marketers and transporters. The 500 billion naira bridging claim is their demand. It is very critical that these bridging claims and product differentials owed to the members of the independent petroleum marketers and the association of distributors and transporters be paid and paid immediately and urgently. Many of them have gone under because of the inability to assess their funds that have been trapped uh, since the uh, defunct petroleum equalization fund has gone out. Now the onus and responsibility falls upon the midstream downstream regulatory agency and we are calling upon them to step up to their responsibilities. Until this is sorted, every action taken to clear the queues is temporary. Accumulated before the passing of the Petroleum Industry Act, one wonders how long it will take to reconcile the books. It doesn't take rocket science for you to print your records and bring it to the table. We sit down with you, go over it, agree on what is owed, so that these gentlemen can run their businesses and also help uh, the totality of the country. What I want Nigerians to understand is that this money that is paid to transport us, it doesn't come from Gamma. It is the Nigerian masses that are contributing this money. The marketers, the, the you, you buy petrol at peeling station. Out of that 135 Naira, 165 Naira, in price template, there are a certain amount that is earmarked to take care of this petroleum transportation. But unfortunately, we independent marketers and the transporters, we are cash and carry marketers. We pay before we even took the product. But it takes us a long time before we get, that, we get that money. To keep business afloat, the Lagos chapter of the Independent Marketers Association of Nigeria announced that its members will begin to sell fuel at 180 naira per liter from Monday. With the intervention of the NNPC, this has been put on hold. Some of these tank farm owners who have gone to collect this product, I don't blame them because the costs of doing business have also changed. It became so, so difficult for them to sell at 148 naira, 17 kobo. But yesterday, I want to tell you that the PPMC and NPC went to their tank farm and released product. You are aware? <laughs> <laughs> that is why we are thanking them that with this product we are now assessing at this 148.17 Kobo. Status quo ante mm -hmm. must be maintained. Yes, exactly. Mm -hmm. The fuel queues are expected to disappear in a few days with NNPC announcing a 30-day supply in store. With this reprieve, the worst has only been postponed as the cost of business increases for depot owners. Half a trillion Naira debt still hanging for transporters and refineries still asleep.